My name is Adria Arch. I'm an artist, a mixed media artist, and a painter. And I have been doing art as for as long as I can remember. And I'm going to talk to you today about the work that was featured in this show in the Bromfield Gallery in Boston in November of 2009. And the title of the show is Glyphs, Wall Constructions, and Works on Paper. These images are based on my son's high school notebook doodles. Um, I was pouring through his notebooks in the hopes of finding <laughs> some written piece of uh, writing that might have helped me to understand him, what was what he was going through as a as a teenager a little bit better. And I didn't find that, but I did find pages and pages of these really interesting doodles. So I decided to use this use these, some of these pages and uh, translate them into art. And if you look up close, you can actually see that they were very painstakingly painted with very tiny brush strokes and sometimes I used metallic pens, so of course that took much, much longer. So the actual reproduction of these lines that took a couple seconds to make when he actually did them took me many, many minutes and sometimes hours to actually recreate. What inspired the color choices? Um, sometimes I just choose colors like this bright pink three panel piece um, because I wanted to choose a very provocative color. And I know that people, that pink is a color that pushes people's buttons and will make them stand up and really look. And um, I happen to really enjoy pink. And so sometimes my color choices are simply very intuitive and I choose a color because I want to see it. Like I use a lot of Payne's gray and just that color is so interesting to me because it changes. Sometimes it really looks very gray and sometimes it can look as blue as a robin's egg depending on what you put it next to. And so I'm just having a lot of fun juxtaposing that color with other colors. The Brownfield space was really fun to work in. It has two quite large rooms and then a smaller bathroom in the back of the gallery that I chose to literally paint right on the walls of that bathroom and make an installation. Um, there was something really exciting about being able to walk right into this space with the doodles all over the ceiling and, the, and, and all four walls. Um, the other, other two main galleries, um, I was very careful to uh, place these paintings so that they would relate well to each other and there was a lot of room for breathing space, if you will. Some of the pieces are very, very tall, right, 10 feet high, and um, they actually work really well because the Brumfield's uh, ceilings are quite high, even higher than that. And the sculptures were placed on the wall, not so that they were like one right next to the other in a more typical gallery installation, but really tried to use the wall as a background for placement of these sculptures so that they talk to each other.